to the higher pressures that the high pressure pump is capable of, the chemical pump, which is also stainless steel, is bolted directly to the side of the pump. The, as a result, the side glass had to be relocated and can be found here. Um, check the oil level on a daily basis. The oil should be in the middle of the glass. There's a dot that you can use to ensure your oil level is correct. The first oil change should come at 50 hours and after that every 500 hours. To change the oil on the other side of the machine, there's a, a again conveniently located oil drain hose to allow you to drain your oil. Use your two wrenches to remove the oil drain hose cap. Once the cap is removed, drain all the oil and once the oil is drained, return the cap to its position using the two wrenches again. Tighten, make sure it's securely tightened. To fill, we recommend you use a funnel which has a hose attached to it. The oil fill cap can be located on the top of the pump here. Remove the cap and route the hose through the machine. You can, this can be done from either side of the machine. Route the hose into the oil fill hole and fill the pump using about a third of a quart of oil. You need to use SAE 30 non-detergent oil. The detergents in that oil or in the oil could chemically erode the pump and prematurely wear the pump to failure. Once you have gotten to the middle of the side glass, then return the oil cap to its place. Securely tighten it. And your, your high pressure pump, oil, all service is complete.